Good morning, welcome to my channel. I'm Nicole. If you're new here, I live in Perth, Australia, and I am currently grocery shopping for my family of six. I have more kids than that, but they've moved out, some of them, so still got four at home. And I've just went to Woolworths and done part A of my shop. I was actually going to go to the spud shed and thought, no, I had a few things on my list from Woolworths that I needed to get, and my um, the pay didn't go in till late last, late, must have gone in really late last night, it was in by this morning. So I wanted to pop in there last night when I picked my daughter up from work, but yeah, didn't happen. So, um, yeah, beautiful day today, so I dropped the young bloke off at school and yeah, went to Woolies. When you only go into the shop for a few things. And look what Woolies has back in stock, my mango chili lime dressing. It's on sale for four bucks this week, normally six. And they also had this creamy parmesan one too. And I'm just going to show you what I bought and then I'm going to go down to Aldi and get the rest of um, the stuff. I'll tell you, um, yeah, what meals I'm sort of making for the week as well, or plan to make for the week. So same as usual, I'll show you the cold things first. They actually had these little blocks of parmesan cheese on special, so $1.50 each. So I've got the extra sharp parmesan and just the traditional one as well. I've got a block of vintage cheddar. This is to take on holidays with us. I've got some cheese, but I think I've only got one, so I thought I'd grab another one of those. I've got a cup, couple of cartons of eggs. Haven't had any eggs for a few days, so happy with that. I've got some turkey mints. I actually want to do taco bowls one night for dinner or a taco salad either or either would be good i've got yeah i've got all the stuff to do a nice taco salad so i might do that and the weather's just perfect to have salad we had veggies the last few nights so change it up a little bit these lifesaver ice ice poles were on special for four dollars they're normally 7.50 a box and there's eight in a box so that's good i've got some CCs, I normally just call them corn chips because I normally get them from Aldi, I don't know what they're even called from there. So I've got some of those, those will go with the taco salad that I make. I've got a big pack of toilet roll, I've literally got probably two rolls of toilet roll left. So 20 pack of those, that was the last one left too. The toilet rolls were actually quite sold out today which is weird. Um, just some lady things, I've got some toilet cleaner. Up the back here I've got lots of cereal, so... My kids cannot complain that there's no cereal this week. We had the Cheerios, there's honey flavour and there's the vanilla flavour. On special for three fifty a box. And then Special K was on special for six bucks. I think that was normally about nine. And the Uncle Toby's ones were four dollars ten each. So I've got the iron one and the antioxidant one. So that one's got cranberries and blueberries in it. And that one's got nutty clusters and cashews. So yeah, good to have some cereal in the house. I've only got pretty much got wheat bix and oats at the moment, so um down behind here I've got a few Pringles. These were half price. There was only four left. One of them was actually open, so I obviously didn't grab that one. Um and I've noticed that they've stopped putting the tops on just the small ones. All the big ones have lids on them, so that's kinda odd. But yeah, I've got a few of those. I've got some more water crackers, uh one to put away for the holiday again and one just for i've got some dips still from the shopping i did the other day this 10 pack of peaches and juice was a good buy five dollars fifty i want to say five fifty let me just check the rest they were only five dollars twenty so that was a really really good buy um i got some italian dressing i'm actually going to buy some more chicken and i'm going to marinate some chicken breast in this it is absolutely beautiful one of my People that I follow on YouTube did it and I thought, you know what, I need to try that. I think I've told you this before if you're used to watching my channel. I've got a water bottle. I'm not buying those ones I always buy because they just go mouldy in the lid. It's just, yeah, they're just stupid. I'm sick of throwing them out. So this one was, I, think, I don't know if I said, three fifty on special half price. I've got some spider gummies for the kids. Vitamin C and zinc in this one. There's 120 in there and they were half price. They're about 15 bucks just under. So that was all right. I got some probiotic chop balls and I got myself some iron melts. There's 50 in here and these were $8. So they're actually really nice strawberry flavored. 
I've got some teriyaki marinade. I also want to get some chicken and just do um, like we'll have chicken. The kids can have rice. Hubby and I will have some cauliflower rice. Actually, I might do that tonight because I've got cauliflower rice left over from last night's dinner. So there's an idea. And we'll just have some broccoli on the side. And I've got some barbecue sauce totally out of that. A couple of boxes of tissues. They were like $1.20 a box, so that was good. Um, some little chocolate coins put away for Christmas. They were $2 a bag. I've got my young bloke. He likes the fruit in the jelly. So these are peaches in strawberry jelly. So I've got two of those. They were about $2.20 for one pack. So that was all right. I got some asparagus. They actually, in the catalogue, it said that these were $1.80 a bunch, but they're actually $1.50. I only got two though, because they're really big and fat. And there's not really many in a bunch. So, and it's in season, so it's cheap everywhere. But I'd rather try and get some that are a little bit thinner so you get more per bunch. Uh, these were $1.75. Uh, we got chicken flavoured and the um, like drumstick, chicken drumsticks. I got this cotton on gift card for my daughter. It's nearly her birthday, so she loves that shop. Thought I'd show you what my daughter bought with her gift card that I got for her birthday. I'll let her use it now, but she's not allowed to have these till her birthday. We'll actually be in Bali on her birthday, so. But she picked two pairs of sunnies. I know, look at these. I love these, I reckon they're gorgeous. And she's got some cute little tops that she bought that will match these ones. And these ones are more like a cola kind of colour. So they were 20 each. And then she picked two big clips. They're pretty decent size. She just got a clear in the back one. They were actually $10 each, so I decided to chuck in another 10 bucks towards it. But yeah, she was pretty excited. She bought some glasses... Uh, no, they're probably more like this one, but they're just off Shein. But they're not actual sunglasses, so. So I said to her, yeah, she's better off getting some that she can actually wear that do the job. So, yeah, just beautiful. I just got some wrapping paper out. I'm going to wrap them up now. And put them up in the barley stuff for her birthday. I've actually ordered um, some donuts from this lady over in Bali. Uh, she's going to bring them to the hotel the day after we arrive and I've also ordered a beautiful birthday cake for her. I'll show you, I'll insert a photo here of the cake. So this is a beautiful cake that I chose for Scarlett. It's costing us $40. It's a vanilla sponge with strawberry jam inside it and it has butter cake icing on it. She's charging us $2 to deliver it to our hotel. It does depend on where you're staying to how much she'll charge you for delivery. And the donuts, we got a mixed box of donuts and we also got a box of ones with custard in there in them. People said on the reviews that even when they're not a real big fan of the custard ones that they are absolutely beautiful. After this clip, I'm inserting a bit where you can see all the different flavours of donuts that you can choose from. They're about twelve fifty a box. So there's the price. And the different flavours. There's quite a few to choose from. And I'm also adding her Facebook page here. Jump on and have a look at all the stuff she's made. And all the reviews are just great. I've got some sugar-free fruit drops. They were on special for two bucks. So they look all right. And I've got some wraps. They had all the wraps were three fifty, so I got some spinach and herb ones and just two packs of original. And they had the potted herbs on special for three bucks. I already planted my other one in the garden, but it can't grow quick enough. So I thought for three dollars I'll grab another two, chuck them in. I also bought this coffee. Um, sorry, I was vlogging and my husband rang, and I totally forgot about it. I just remembered that I stopped. I literally had one more thing, and that was it. So. So my total that I spent in Woolworths is $259.20, which wasn't, wasn't too bad compared, oops, um, seeing as I got the gift card for 50 so, and a couple of bigger things that were a bit more expensive, so not too bad. I've just done my meal plan, 
So this week, oh, sorry you can't see my eyes. <laughs> um, this week on the menu we have silver side, going to do cauliflower cheese and cauliflower and broccoli cheese and mashed potato on the side. I'm going to do the teriyaki chicken with the rice and broccoli. I'm going to do the taco salad bowls. We're going to have salmon wedges and salad one night. I'm going to do a sweet and sour pork. I'm going to make my own sauce for that. I've done it before and it was really good. I've got like a little like chunk of meat in there from um, HelloFresh that I've got to use. So I thought I'd make the sweet and sour pork with it. And we're going to have a barbecue on the weekend. So that would be steak and sausages and salad. And I'm going to do the marinated chicken in the Italian dressing. And I've got some butter chicken. I've got butter chicken paste in there, but I'm kind of feeling like I'm over butter chicken at the moment. I might just not worry about that. But um, I'll see what else they have. If they have any other specials on meat or anything else discounted, and then I can add it to the menu for the week. So let's go to Aldi. I've got these two seventy nine. I've got one for dollar seventy nine. That's good. I tend to look along this bit first before I buy anything else. Get some sort of good stuff. Okay, so the bananas are four dollars a kilo in here. They were two dollars at Coles. I don't know if they still are. I don't want to risk going in there because I'm going to buy other stuff. I think I might just get a little bunch from here. Also got the asparagus for the same price as Woolies. So we've got a couple of them. Actually they're not yeah, so they're a bit smaller. Some of them are still big. Pink lady apples, three dollars fifty a kilo, I'm gonna get some more of those. Blueberries are cheap, they're two ninety nine upon it. I have got two pots at home and they're absolutely covered in them. I was actually eating some before when I was watering, they're just beautiful. So that's a good buy. The medley tomato mix, 400 grams on special for 3.99. I don't like the dark ones in them though, so it's not bad. Okay, I am back from Aldi. Quite happy with my shop today. Show you a little glimpse of what I got. I like days like this because I don't need to hurry up and get everything put away so quick. It's just such a beautiful day. Um, starting with the cold stuff, I got two packs of rump steak that'll be for the barbecue on the weekend and i've got some sausages that'll be two meals i'll split those um into two and we'll use half of the barbecue got this mince half of this will be for i'm going to do taco bowls one night i'm going to do taco salad and taco bowls totally different thing one's a hot meal one's a cold one so yeah i thought i can do Half of this will be for the taco bowls and the other half I'm going to do spaghetti bob with. Um, I've got some turkey, like, can you call it, just turkey meat. It's four, there's four separate little packs. And I am actually going to use these light cheese slices and roll some of the turkey up in those for hubby for his lunchbox just to healthy little snack for him to have uh, what have I got here some sour cream some light sour cream I've got a big tub of normal sour cream in the fridge but I really want the light one I've got a silver side um, a bag actually I've got two bags of the tasty light cheese I want to make some cauliflower cheese and that like I said with a silver side so I'll make the cheese sauce with some light cheese and I'll put a bit of parmesan in it too um, I've got some well this isn't cold but this is just this corner I've got some of these tortilla strips um, with the white corn hubby and I will have these with the taco bowls that I'll do and some with the taco salad as well a bit healthier than the cc's I've got some of this egg fettuccine. I bought some this so long ago and cooked it up. And my daughter ate some of her dinner and put the rest in the fridge. And her brother ate it and she was, he didn't know he ate the wrong meal. And she was devastated. So I thought I'd get one of them. It was like 3 dollars for the packet. So, yeah, tri-colour 
egg fettuccine so she'll be happy when she sees that when she gets home i got the two packets of chicken breast pretty good it's like 10 49 a kilo i still can't believe chicken breast is cheaper than chicken thighs now so odd frozen veggies i got two packs of mixed veggies and what's that potato corn beans peas and carrot and i've got some corn cobs and some peas these two will be for mixing in with the dog food we might have some with something if i feel like it um what else we got oh, i'm gonna go to the back there so over the back i've got some coconut milk just the light one i've got some black beans some corn kernels and kidney beans I've got lentils over this side too. They will be one of the each of the cans will go into my taco soup. I've got four of the diced tomatoes. I've got some salsa. They will be for the taco salad to put on top. And I've got some just pasta sauce. I bought two of those. I'll only use one of those in that half. A pack of that big mince. Um, Dog food, I've got six of those cans, and like I said, I'll bulk that up with some veggies and some pasta. They love that. I've got some more pineapple. I've got one tin in my pantry, but I'm going to make my sweet and sour sauce out of the juice, so I needed to make sure that I had enough because I need like three quarters of a cup. Two loaves of white bread, two loaves of raisin toast, or raisin bread will be raisin toast. Boys, older boys love that. I've got another tub of margarine. I've got some beetroot. That will be for or one will be for the barbecue and i'll also use one of the corn for the barbecue as well um down this way i've got some couscous just one box of that i've got quite a bit of salmon in the freezer so i thought we can either do salmon with couscous which everybody loves or i could do it with wedges just depends what i can be bothered doing really uh, i've got some of these crust sort of biscuits crackers Oh, that's weird. I was just telling the lady at Aldi how I had a pack of these sitting on my bench and they had bugs in them. But they seem to have little holes in the packet. Looks like holes. Definitely looks like holes. Maybe it's just, um, oh, I know what it's from the pasta because they're sharp and poking through the packet. It does seem to be in a straight line though. But yeah, I had a packet the other week and I had it sitting on the bench and it was full. Within five minutes it was full of like these black beetle things that had all come up to the top of the packet. It was really odd. So she's just saying, you know, everything like that, you just got to bring it back because they need to know about it as well. So I was like, well, if you don't have your receipt, what do you do, you know? And I did take some funky chicken back last week too that was like feral wasn't even out of date yet and it was so gross i bought myself a well not myself i bought a block of butter i've been real stingy haven't really been buying it it's pretty much gone up a dollar a block so but it is better for you than margarine so i thought stuff it i'll just get one um over this way i've got a few antibacterial foaming wash i do have a big bottle of the refill under my kitchen sink but I ended up taking the bottle like this into the bathroom because that one's just normal liquid soap and it'd run out. So I'd rather have this antibacterial stuff in the bathroom. But I've never seen this fragrance before, cherry blossom. I just couldn't resist that. And this one is vanilla and wild berry. I think they've had this one before. But yeah, had to get me some of them. I actually picked up two of each and I was like, no, put two back. <laughs> So, uh, some sweet chilli sauce, that will go with some wedges. I've got some fly spray, it's getting into that stupid season where there's heaps of flies. One of them is actually going to get put away for barley. I've got one put away. I like to take my own because the fly spray over there kills you when you spray it, it's really bad. I've got some dishwasher tablets and I've got a few marked down milks. I thought bugger it with all that cereal that I bought. I'll just get them. It only saved me a dollar, so it wasn't really a great saving, but the kids really like normal milk so be a little bit of a treat for her i guess um i got some uh wipes i actually got a, i'll show you this i got a pack one packet of spaghetti too before i forget i always do a vlog and forget something on the table so i've really gotta make sure i don't um 
yeah, so these are anti-wrinkle. Good luck with that. <laughs> Cleansing wipes for myself. And I've got my daughter the sensitive skin ones. Got some more makeup removers. And moving into my fresh produce. They had the cubes for $2.99. So I've got two of the six. Well, there's, yeah, it's actually six in a, in a pack. They're 250 grams. I've got some of the asparagus, as you saw in videoing. They were pretty good, so I've got four bunches of that now. I've got a bag of avocados. Look how many's in here. And it was like $5. Two, four, six, eight. There's ten avocados in there. I mean, they're not huge, but how much avocado do you use? I reckon they're a perfect size. And I've got the snow peas. They were like on special for four bucks. So that was good. Grab two of those. Main snack, Harvey and I have been eating. This week we've been having uh, snow peas, carrot, some little uh, cukes, and just some chopped up capsicum. So these were 10 bucks a kilo, but they're pretty nice. We're well, not in there, it's pretty shit. But, but um, yeah, so I've got a bag of carrots, they were 99 cents. Got the apples, they were 3 50 Love that with almond butter. I've got some tomatoes, that'll be for the taco salads. I've got lettuce and that in the fridge and I've got cheese, so that's okay. And I've got the um, extra beans and corn and stuff will be for that as well. I've got a bag of potatoes. I don't buy potatoes very often. You'll know that if you watch my channel. Um, they just really don't get used. They tend to grow before they get eaten. But I'm going to use half of them for the silver side meal and... Um, the other half I'm going to do maybe just some smash spuds, boil them up and then just slightly, I've, I've videoed the other week and you just sort of like put them in the frying pan with a little bit of butter and oil and just push them down to they sort of pop open a little bit and they're just beautiful. Oh, your own wedges, but they take a long time to cook. I should have got an air fryer now, so maybe not. Um, but they're about five, six bucks, a, um, four kilo bags. That was okay. Now I've got some nanas. And that's it for my Aldi stuff. And yesterday in the morning, I did pop into Woolies before I dropped the young bloke at school. And I got some snack bags. And he wanted some chai lattes. He loves those. So I got them. And I also bought a big pack of the skim milk cappuccinos for myself. And I bought everyone a, pardon me, a Mars bar to go on the airplane with as well. Aldi shopping came to $300.70, so, which is pretty good. I'm actually quite happy with my shop today. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go and pack it away and sit down for a little bit, and then I'm going to walk over and get my son. So thanks for watching my vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm going to pack all my shopping away and go sit down for a little bit. I'm actually going to walk over and get the young bloke from school this afternoon. So he's quite excited about that. And then, yeah, chill and I've got work tomorrow. I've actually just um, had a change in jobs. <laughs> so yeah, the other job just wasn't working out. I just, yeah, wasn't, just wasn't happy in it. Um, and it's so bloody cold and I hate the cold so I kept saying to the, yeah, the boss oh, I don't want to be in that bit wasn't enjoying it so I moved me out in the other bit and then I didn't enjoy that so yeah it just wasn't really working but yeah got me a new job and I'm going to start there tomorrow I'm really looking forward to it I'm really looking forward to just not being so bloody cold <laughs> so okay I'll see you in my next vlog bye